Okay, keto bays. So I decided to make that feta pasta again. This is round two. Um, I'm just going to walk you through what I did. With this block of feta, I cut it into cubes so then the feta would cook faster. And then that's just one container of cherry tomatoes. I added four cloves of minced garlic. I love that tool, by the way. It's so legit. And then olive oil, cracked black pepper, and garlic salt. You want to make sure that all of the tomatoes are coated with the oil so then they can cook evenly. The garlic that's on top of the feta, I actually ended up moving on top of the tomatoes. That's like the 10 minute mark and then this is after 15 minutes. So everything cooks faster in the Ninja. That's crushed red pepper and then some fresh basil. So what I ended up doing is because I ran out of low carb pasta and so I decided to make it a dip and I had leftover tortilla chips from the other day and it was freaking delicious. The Mission tortillas taste like pita chips and so this was a really good combo. And then I wanted David to actually try it the way that it's supposed to be eaten and so I picked up these mini bow tie pasta noodles or farfalle from Trader Joe's and I added them to the mix. And while I was doing that, I decided to add some grated parm because I personally think this tastes like the penne rosa from Noodles & Company. But yeah, it's super good, super easy. Try it out. 